today's adventure brings us into the bright lights, the hustle and bustle of Baltimore City to this small, unassuming, quiet, and most likely overlooked side street right in the heart of Baltimore to visit the birthplace of quite possibly and arguably the greatest baseball player of all time. Hey everyone, this is Walt from Mouse Talk back with another video and today I'm taking you along with me as we visit the birthplace and museum of quite possibly the greatest baseball player of all time. I think he's the greatest of all time. George Herman Ruth, you know him better as the Babe. Babe Ruth, let's get inside. Come along with me on a fun adventure. don't know the babe loved children absolutely loved children as you can see in this picture he makes no bones about it he was loving the children and he was there for them supported them and he loved them lots of information on the babe there's his family there he is with the kids he loved children. There's the babe's rosary. Pretty awesome stuff. There's the babe himself. One hundred years of the babe. These a pair of his game-worn jersey pants. One by the apes held all sort of records. And there's one of his game-used bats right there. So there you go. I 
really enjoy that. Thirty-six ounce bat. That's incredible. Here's some of his lifetime stats. Look at the home run, 714. Pretty awesome. And what everybody seems to forget is, as much of a great hitter as he was, he was also a great pitcher. He was a great pitcher as well. Now, of course, the Babe, everybody knows the Babe was with the Yankees, but what they don't realize is he actually started his career with the Boston Red Sox. And the Red Sox were having financial issues at the time, and they traded him to the New York Yankees for money, basically, and the rest is history. Here's the house that Ruth built, otherwise known as Yankee Stadium. Pretty awesome.
four hitters, two of the greatest hitters of all time. Of course, the Babe, Babe Ruth and his friend, and one of the greatest hitters himself, the Iron Horse, Lou Gehrig. And the 500 Home Run Club, a very exclusive club of all the players that played in Major League Baseball. That's the list at that time of those who were on and make the Home Run Club of 500. Not many. There have been more that have been added since, but there aren't that many on there. And some of these players, you can see their home run balls and their autographs right there. 